What are you doing? <laughs> She's being insulting. playing the drums. <laughs> you missed Hi. it. Hi. <laughs> Hello. If you've got it, blonded. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> Sure and say hi if you're on. We're having fun tonight already. Yeah, we are having some fun tonight. <laughs> what do you okay. want to do? I'm so doing pins and show and tell on that, I guess. Hi, Julie. Hi, Debbie. So, hi, Brenda. Head of the show. No, she's not. Brenda from yeah. Garden City. Well, hi. I didn't have anything. And she's Joan doing just everything. Hi, Beverly. How is everybody? Say hello when you jump on. Hi, Jennifer, Patsy, Kathy, Diane. Somebody's Hi, jumping Tom. on. Yeah. <laughs> That's my shit. That's your shit. Hi, Kitty. Hi, yeah, Carol. Welcome. What was I going to do with Devon? It's probably the pin and the cat. No, it wasn't. It was It was chatting while cutting. <gasps> Ooh. It was. Yeah. I still do that. <laughs> yeah, I can. Hello, all our Instagram followers. Do I need to bring my piece of material over that shows what I did? Hi, Cindy. Hi, Lana. If you want. Hi, Jennifer. Yes, I bought it. <laughs> well, maybe you could maybe you could sell it. Somebody might want More wine yard slushies. Yard and I'll sign it, right? <laughs> you know what? I think we may get a wine slushy machine. So yes. for events. Yeah. Hi, Diana. Hi, Sherry. Oh, come on. Yeah. So. Staff can't have it. It's for customers. Say what? <laughs> oh, what? Ellen. Hi, welcome. Maybe <clears throat> after. Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us. Hi, Joan. <laughs> Hi, Robert. What are you up to? What's going on this month? So This month? We're back to our normal broadcasting, so... We are back on uh, YouTube, Instagram, was it that Facebook. One? So, what? <laughs> Hi, Kitty. What's normal about? Hi, Debbie. Show? We're a little slap yeah. happy tonight. Yeah. So it's been a day. It's been it, a little bit of a long day been. for us. So. So. Um, Who are we? We are Quilters HQ, Windmill Sewing Center, and Sewing Machines Express. Um, Windmill Sewing Center and Quilters HQ are in, Can in uh, Overland Park, Kansas, and Sewing Machines Express is in Springfield, Missouri. So, Ooh. websites: Springfield is QHQ and the number two dot com. Quilters HQ is QuiltersHQ.com. Windmill Sewing Center is WindmillSewingCenter com. So we do these shows every Tuesday. So today I'm going to show you how to do a roll pin on a serger. It's super easy on this one. Um, it's pretty cool. And We've got a few. Show you how to thread it too. I'll show you how to thread this one too. We do um, got a uh, few dem or uh, new products tonight as some, well. We got some new stuff. New fabrics, little uh, the batiks, yeah, stash busters, <laughs> builders, stash builders. Builders. Okay. They're cool. They're batiks too. They'll hold up the rest of your stash. <laughs> Hi Georgia. Kind of like little. Hi Deborah. Colors. Yeah. So if you're just joining us, this is Make It So. Yes, we do this every Tuesday from. Six to seven central time. Um, We've really been working to get our events going again, and we just had we one. We just had one, a so. Kimberbell event. It was great. Everybody had a lot of fun. Yeah, it was nice to see people um, social yeah. distancing, but back together again. Yes. So that was fun. Um, and I think we've got some upcoming stuff. So what else, what else do we got coming up? I don't know. I asked you that earlier. Oh, you did. Okay. <laughs> well, there's going to be some So Steady Wednesdays coming up in November oh, right. and December. So that's we're going to so do... Steady ruler work. Ruler work. There's a beginning one and there is an intermediate one and uh, then a products. So those will be kind of fun coming those up and we'll get some details. And they register for that on the So Steady website, right? Um, yes, I believe so. I'm finishing up the details on it, and then we'll send some stuff out. So keep an eye on our social channels as well as email. Do you know how much they cost? Um, I don't know that they cost anything. Uh, I, I don't know what they are. So I shouldn't say that. Okay. So. Um, what else do we got going on? Bernina Academy coming up. Yes. So October. Find your inner sewer. October 16th and 17th. We still have seats for that, too. Yeah. 
So if you're interested in that, you might uh, that contact. That would be windmillsewingcenter.com, or you can call the store. Yep, get signed up. There's some seats still open for that. We'd love to fill those up, and it's going to be a lot of fun. It's also, I believe it's uh, Bernina Super Saturday that so that, extra uh, Saturday special. as well. So there'll be some specials going on as well. And if you haven't been to one of our events, they're a lot of fun. Robert is kind of a nut. <laughs> yeah. Is that, that why you're so worn out today? You've been to too many events? Yeah, it was just going and going at the event, and it was a lot of fun. So, so. there's great lunches, there's great sewing, you'll meet new people, we'll have fun. We're bringing in an educator from Bernina. Yep. So, give us a call. Yeah. Sign up for that. What else is going on? Um, I think it's, we're going to start a new embroidery project here at Quilters. Can't show you what it is yet, so look Stay for tuned. details on that coming. Okay. And I think that's it. Well, you got a, you got a little pin on there today. What is yes. this? What is Can you see? It's a little pin. There's two of them. Okay. So they're, what are these little guys? They're magnetic. So you don't have to put holes in your clothes. Holes in your clothes. That's hard, hard to say. Holes in your clothes. <laughs> Hi, Sharon. So they're magnetic. So they, they kind of snap together like that. These are really strong magnets, too. They're not so difficult that you can't get them apart, but I like the bee. There is also a sewing machine. Yeah, that one's cool. These, but not the cup. But not the, not the little fire cup. Um, these retail for $16.99, but Robert said to put them on sale tonight. So what's the price? $11.99. $11.99. So there's two patterns. So you have the, we'll use this one. You have the B. These are from Bonnie and Camille. And so if you want one of these, comment, make it mine. Hi, Kathy. Sewing machine pin or B pin, and we'll get one out to you. If you haven't shopped with us before, then you um, need to go to one of our websites and register for Make It So. We will get your information and let us know whether or not you want us to ship or to uh, come in the store and pick it up. And so what we will do is we will email you an invoice, which has a clickable pay button on it. You can pay with a credit card or PayPal. And once you do that, we will send it off to you. Shipping is $4.99 unless you spend $75 or more, and then it's free. Hi, Ellen. Um, looks like Donna. Hi. Hi, Donna. Hi, Donna. Donna's out there trying to make some 3D face masks. Oh, cool. So that sounds interesting, like an interesting hmm. project. Great little gifts for the holidays that's coming up. Cool. So that's the other thing I was thinking about the old hymn. It's coming Napkins. fast. It's nine. already October almost. I know. Can you believe that? Just... It's flown by. Almost. But it's Hi, still Christine. September. So I'm hanging on to summer yeah. for what is it like a couple more days till fall? No. Nope. We're it's past. Yep. Oh. See, we're, we're in there. Or today. Yeah. So yeah. I think yeah, I think you're right. I think it's the twenty first, first day of fall. Twenty second. Twenty second. So then it's today. Yeah. Happy first day of fall. Bye summer. It's it was nice also, knowing you. It's also National Sewing Month. <laughs> Did you know that? Yeah. Tell, tell everybody Declared what you Declared by Ronald Reagan in 1982. You've been That's looking at books again. Happy now, little you? trivia. Yeah, you know, got to read every now and then. Well, let's get started. Yeah. Susan has show and tell. Okay. <laughs> I like that, Patsy. What she always wanted for Christmas was a mask. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's great. Okay, so Wouldn't it's September sewing month, and so I sewed today. I finished up some masks that I had at home, and then I bought one of the um, microwavable bowl Forms. templates that we had, and so I made one this afternoon. I took a jelly roll and sewed five strips, two different five strip groupings and put it together but one thing I did is in the instructions it says when you lay your fabric to the template the batting 
you sew I a crisscross that kind of secures your fabric and they're calling it that's your quilting i didn't even think about it i just sewed and i used white thread well that didn't look so hot with these colors so i just went back over it with the decorative stitch on my elna 920. so design element then mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and in doing that i had one half of it was still flat so it was really easy to do the other side I had already sewn the darts and had a bowl-shaped form, so I just sat it down and did it while it was in that form and straightened it out as I went, but they're really fun, and they don't take a long time. How long did it take? Now, you're asking me. <laughs> and this was of first. Of course. Well, sure. 12 I'm, minutes? Oh, <laughs> sure. It took me longer than that to pick out the colors I wanted. Hi, uh, Janie. I'd say you could probably finish this long, hour and a half, short, 45 minutes. Nice little sewing project. Yeah, so it, yeah. it's really not that complicated. I don't know that I'd ever put it in the microwave because I, why let it get messed up like that with grease and crumbs? But, but if you do, you got to take bowls to somebody's house. This is true, but you have to use 100% cotton thread and 100% cotton fabric. Hi, Jerry. Because if you don't, you put it in the microwave, you can have a little bowl fire. So, no bowl fire. There's that. Is there so, it was fun. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Send Stacey. pictures of the ones you've been doing. That'd be great. Uh, can I tell a fish story? I don't know. How big is it? <laughs> That's the whole point. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Saturday. My husband and I and my sister-in-law and her son got together at my nephew's home and they have an over, well, it's a small Hi, lake. And he had a little barge that some people can get on and take food. And there were four of us and we had food all over and containers and he's trolling us around the lake. And all of a sudden, my nephew Nick jumps up and hollers. And I thought, wow, something fell into the water or something broke. And we turned around and looked, and over four foot, over 50 pound carp flung itself on top of the barge. <laughs> and we were just shocked, including Nick, because he had no idea there was a fish that large in their lake. And he'd never seen it, never seen anything. None of us had seen anything like that. And it was gone as soon as it had gotten up there, but it was pretty amazing. So that's my fish story. How big was it? That big? It was over four <laughs> foot, and that's not a tail. <laughs> Did you have your measuring stick there? Well, I no, but the space that he jumped onto, it was easy to kind of <clears throat> calculate, you know. But it was amazing. It was just utterly amazing. Compared to that, my husband was catching fish like this, so... <laughs> I like my fish story. So uh, we had a viewer comment on your bowl. It could also be used for cold, like ice cream or something. Mm -hmm. so you have your bowl so of ice cream. We do have another thing we can use it for. Can you come around here, Robert? <laughs> Marilyn and Robert discovered this option. We're storming the castle. <laughs> and he face. said something about sewing flaps on and yep. then a tie. Ear flaps. Ear flaps. That's yep. right. Yep. So it has all sorts of options. I always think of containers. Uh, that will hold M and M's. I don't so know. I think that would How work. About a bread basket, little little pieces of bread. Yep. Whatever. <laughs> All right, moving All right. on. Melba toast. Melba toast. Melba toast. There, you, there go. you go. There you go. Hi, Linda Tracy. Next, next. So that's hers now. You're gonna do that now. Who's doing the? All right. That? Okay. Where do you want to go to? You want to do? What, what do you want to do? Let's next? do these. Okay. This okay. Is what New really, products. Really yeah, wants. the batiks. Fabric. These. All right. Comment if you Are like you batiks. No, you're doing them. Okay. Then get out of here. I'm going. Move. Oh, see. <laughs> so, so sassy. She's got a grump on tonight. <laughs> no. No. Just territorial. That's all. She it's likes the batiks. Thing. Yes. We Very got much. these in yesterday. And these are so cool. In a variety of colorways and a variety of designs and these are hard to find batiks in black and there are some batiks in black they are five inches wide 
and with the fabric, so 42 inches long. So they would work in your go cutter to do two and a half inch strips. Uh, you could do that with these and make the bowl and you'd have strips left over. They all have a little bit of a variance in the designs. They are $5.99 each and what we're going to do is if you want these, make it mine, tell us how many you want, and give us a color because we're going to choose what we mail out to you. Well, it's a it's mystery. Just, it's a mystery. Oh, I like that. But you, you don't can, know what you're going to get. How many get? strips are on each one? Is there five? Four. Four? And what's the total yardage? <sighs> 20 inches. Total yardage of the whole package. Yeah, so and Kathy was saying... It's one roll. Kathy was saying it's, black is hard to find right now. It's a little over a half yard. A little over a half yard, I'm told. With four <clears> different <throat> colors or patterns. So, we have blues, that's a couple. We have greens, oh, those are too much alike. Greens, okay. I'm gonna grab a couple of the blacks. This one's got, uh, yeah. It's like black with some blue in it. This one's got a pattern in it, but they're all different. Every one of these is different. We have some yellows. We have some pastels. We have some great pinks. I'm running out of pants. <laughs> and we have some beautiful purples and lavenders. So, $5.99 each. Make it mine. Give us a color. These are island batiks. Island batiks, yes. Yep. And those are always wonderful. Yeah, they do have nice. Uh, and batiks. some of these have some really unique patterns to them. There's one in here Joan found that has the Texas star on it. Nice. So they're different than what you've probably been seeing out. So give us how many you want, whether you want them shipped or pick up, and a color. And we will send you out a surprise package. Mystery batik roll. Yes. Mm -hmm. But they are fun. Mm. Okay. What Maybe was the size again? On those? Five inches by with the fabric, 42. Which will come up to about a half a yard, Joan said. Give or take. It's, it's about 72, Kathy. Somewhere in there. It's not super hot. For the first day of fall. For the first day of fall, yeah. So there are some really fun ones in here. I mean, if you can tell here. Well, and if you're going to get any, you better get them before Nina gets on there because she's liable to order them all. <laughs> all right, we're having Hi, Karen. trouble keeping our hands off of all of them. <laughs> yeah. But they are exactly. fun, and they're called Stash Builders. builders. Not Stash Editions, Stash, stash Busters. Builders. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> What's next? All right. Um, we got. We have. Sissy's going to do this one. Okay. Okay. Oh, you moved my pen. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was. I didn't know it was like in a certain position. Oh, it was hard to see. That's why oh. I bought this. Because I did that. I see. <laughs> This What's is, going on, Marilyn? This is my tip of the night. Oh, safety tip. Safety tip time. Yeah. Of a little bit different kind. Mm -hmm. So when you're cutting fabric, it's a good idea if you're not talking at the same time. Now, I know sometimes that's hard to do. Anyhow, it is for me, especially in here. I was cutting a panel for someone today and now I lost my thing again <laughs> oh, how awful when you lose your thing it's just maddening um, and I was talking and having a good time like I usually do because it's fun in a quilt store and I love working in here so um, I'm looking 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 
That's why I had my pen in there. Oh, no. Yeah. She's lost her well, place. Anyway, I we hand cut these because you never know if, if the line's going to match each other yep. to do two, you know, one at a time, cut one at a time. Well, so I was cutting and I was talking and, you know, you don't want to unroll the whole thing. You just want to unroll enough so that you can kind of pull it apart. And so this was the panel that she wanted. And I'm going to hold it up to the light to see if I can find the spot <laughs> that I screwed up, messed up. Oh, there it is. You see where my finger's peeking through? <coughs> I was talking and talking and snipping and snipping, and I snipped a hole in the next panel. So oh. I went ahead and bought it for myself because I figured I ruined it myself because <laughs> I was talking all the time. And I'm going to take Hi, it home. And if I Hi, decide Treva. I don't like the subject matter, more of those. Uh, yes, we do. And and they're cute. And I, I at first the thought, flamingos. well, you know, if nothing else, I can cut it up if I'm making a quilt or something and I see a color or something on there I like, I can, you know, well, you can cut do that one piece of those out. strips. Yeah. Like use for the... yeah. I mean, they're all different things you could do. But then I thought, my neighbor has some flamingos in her flower garden up front. And maybe she would appreciate a panel oh, like that. that's nice. So since my cut was a little, just a little off the edge of the border, or at the edge of the border, I could maybe... We have coordinating fabric that'll go... Yeah, yeah, I can maybe cut that border down or put something else on it or glue it. Hot can fix. I glue it? Hot yeah. fix? Yeah, mm -hmm. I can do something to it. But anyhow, don't talk and cut at the same time because it could have been your finger. Or your cat's paw. You well, never know. Well, so. Kathy's going with the uh, safety tip of the week here because she said uh, always wear steel-toed shoes in your sewing room in case your rotary cutter drops. Oh, that's a good idea. Ask her well, how I, she knows. How do, you, <laughs> how do you know that, Kathy? Uh, hi, Brenda. Oh, I guess Kathy's not yeah. going to tell us. Anyway, yeah, along those lines, last week I showed you this nifty little zipper bag in pink that you put your rotary cutter in, and it has a place to store a couple other items in there if you want to, and that's great for a retreat, you know, or stick it in anywhere, and you don't have to worry about cutting yourself, but today I discovered that it comes in neon green, too. Nice. These are $10.99. If you want one, write in, make it mine, rotary case, pink or green, whichever color you want, Hi, Ruth. and we'll ship that out to you. Just say ship or you'll come in and pick it up. So that's, I, I wanted to update you on the color of that. So that's that. Hi, Becky. <clears throat> I've got a lot of little stuff to show you. So I have drawstring mask elastic, and I know we have quite a few people that come in and ask for that. Mm -hmm. And these are really neat because they're adjustable, and they're made out of a, a really soft uh, material, so it's not as irritating as that cord maybe that comes around your ears. Those are $16.99. I'm going to put my glasses on just for the fun of it. <laughs> maybe I'll see something. Uh, $16.99. And there are 60 in a package, so that's a pretty good deal. And if you want it, say mask elastic, make it mine, mask elastic. And uh, whether you want it shipped or whether you want to come in and pick it up, $16.99 for that. And we have several packages we of it. We have five left. We they only went, have five wow, left. Wow, they went they quick. Were, they were out on the counter today. Really? Well, yeah. People just bought them, huh? Well, they went fast, so you better get it in here fast if you would like to have them. They look pretty yep. cool to me. And they'll, they'll hide dirt, too. So yeah. They're gray, so they they're gray and they'll go with most any material that you would mm -hmm. choose, too. Yeah. They're not stark like those white ones. Um, the other thing we wanted to let you know is our Acorn Precision Piecing products. And um, we have this fabric treatment that's like sizing. It's back in the store. It goes really quick. So we just wanted to let you know that it's back in the store. And if you've been waiting for it, it's $15.99. Say, make it mine. Easy press. Um, and whether you want to ship it or whether you want to come into the store and pick it up. 
Okay. They wanted to see kind of what these look like, so if you'll hold them up, I'll try to get a really close picture. Well, you can open it up and pull one out. Yeah. Sure, yes. Well, you have to rip it out. No, you, you don't. You just... Yep. Okay. We'll I'll show you what one looks Joan like. Joan knows everything. I just wait for her to tell me how to do it because I don't. These are the, uh, am I getting it in the right spot? Um, yep. That's okay. pretty good close up there. So, so here's the little thing that you adjust string. it with. Yep. And here are the ends that you sew into your mask. And it's just, and it is just very, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is soft and it is nice. I so bet. I'd hop right on that. If I'd known they were going that fast, I might have done some for myself, but I haven't made a mask lately. <laughs> I keep wearing the same one time. <laughs> Last thing, guys. I was trucking around the store to see what I wanted to show you tonight, and I ran across this book, and you know how much I like the books in here. So this one is a Tula Pink 100 Modern Quilt Blocks. And she has, you don't have to have the fabric that she makes these out of. Use your imagination. But the patterns and the way she puts them together are just so unique, and it has so many great ideas. I think that you could probably bust your stash with this <laughs> um, to make room for the stash builders mm, yeah, to, make, to rebuild yeah. your stash yeah. right? so you, you're working at both ends that's kind of nice but anyhow it gives you some great modern ideas rather than the typical uh, older quilts and the things we're used to seeing I just I think these are wonderful and the colors are great um, but I think that you can duplicate or get the idea of some of them I love these that kind of use a, um, a single tree or a single pattern in a block. How oh, perfect with these. And yeah, your batiks would look great in some of this stuff too. So um, just keep that in mind. This book, and it gives the, gives the number of pieces. It shows you how to make them. Um, they're just, it's just a fabulous book for ideas. And, I, and so it's a $27.99, which I don't think is bad. And it has a hundred blocks in it. And it is really quite a, like it's 255 pages. So you know That's it's just lot, chock yeah. full of, of wonderful things. So let us know, say Make It Mine, Tula Pink Book. Tula is T-U-L-A. And um, it's $27.99. Tell us whether you want it shipped or whether you want to come in and pick it up. And I think we have three of these in stock. So um, I think that's my part of the evening and I think Susie's got one more thing and then we have a demonstration is that right yeah Georgia okay so I'm gonna get out of her way <clears throat> I didn't work today but when I came in Joan said we got Oops, these sorry. kits the kit is cotton shot by Amanda Murphy and it's called diamonds the quilt is 56 and a half by 85 and a half. We have the kits with the fabric. And if Robert can get in here, we can kind of go through this. This is kind of a psychedelic butterfly print. Then these uh, solid tones, they're kind of jewel. They're just beautiful. So it's going to be a lot of different colors, a lot of different variants, and it almost looks like they've got the backing in, or no, this is the background piece. The background. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is always a confuser. Now, this does not have a pattern in it because... Oh, what are you doing? It's a sew along. Oh, cool. Okay. The kit for the sew along is $119.99. Then shop. on October 14th, there will be a sew along at, you want to write this down, weallsew.com. And Chloe will post it as well. Right. So in the. Now, I don't know uh, how often. That will be if it's weekly, bi-weekly, monthly. I don't have those details. 
Um, I think the piecing is one day, and then they're going to go into quilting with rulers, too. Oh, oh wow. wow. So. I don't know if you heard that. Joan said she felt as though the piecing was in one day, and then they're going to go into quilting with rulers. So it sounds very interesting, but go to wealso.com for more information, and we have the kits for $119.99. So That's make it, it mine. Amanda Murphy Diamonds kit, ship or pick up, but these colors are just pretty amazing, and I hope that you all are interested in that. So that's all I've got tonight. Well, hang on just a second. We got a technical difficulty there. Yeah, we can't do the demo if we can. Yeah, it shouldn't be having issues. It's waiting for a connection. All right. Sorry about that. A little disconnect there. So moving on. Um, yeah, you might go back just at the end part there. Okay. They were able to hear the audio, but um, where, where they go and how. Again, the information, it's a sew along on wealso.com on October 14th. So you probably need to pull that up to see what all the information is on that. And we have the kits for $119.99, Make It Mine, Amanda Murphy, Sew Along, Diamond Kit. Whether you want us to ship it or you'll pick it up. So we hope that you all are curious and interested to take that on. Um, it'll be a fun project. It's got great colors. I just, I like the psychedelic. Who did that? It wasn't Andy Warhol, but there was an artist that did a lot of that in the 70s. Um, this kind I of don't know. splash of color. That was all over. There'll be a viewer yeah. out there. Mm -hmm. That was everywhere. everywhere. Yeah. 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 So it's very reminiscent the of 70s. the 70s. So, okay. Yeah, it's back. The 70s can, are back. Can you go through the kit again for them? Show sure. the picture just so they can see it again since we kind of got cut off a little bit there. Here's a picture of the quilt. It's, okay. it's almost 3D looking. It's kind of cool. It's yeah. 56 and a half by 85 and a half. No pattern. No you pattern. You've got to go to wealso.com for the sew along to get the pattern to be able to make the quilt. Um, yep. Yeah, we don't have a whole lot of information in this booklet, so you're going to have to go to We All Sew. And it's Amanda Murphy, and I know she does wonderful designs. She does. So this is your background. Let's show the fabrics again. So nice. you can see what that's going to look like on that background. That's nice. Uh, I think we've got all of these showing except for the dark orange. Yeah, very and modern here are the too. Other coordinating fabrics. So yeah, I Pretty. love all these colors. Yeah. I like big block quilts. They go together quick. Mm -hmm. mm. I think it'll be fun. I don't know that I'm going to be able to partake in it. It's on a Wednesday, so <laughs> unless Joan lets me do it at the store, so that we have a <laughs> sample to hang up, that would be awesome. <laughs> How many you might kids? comment on that, you know, <laughs> and rally ten. in for me. <laughs> we have ten kits. We have ten kits. Ten total of those. Yeah. So. Yeah. And so. when does it start? October 14th. October 14th. So you still got off. a little bit of time? Yeah, this yeah. is what, a little over about two and a half weeks? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Close enough to time it, yeah. to get the kit to you. And yep. All right. Okay. What else do we have? And even if you don't want to do the kit, I mean, it's cool fabrics. Yeah, oh, it yeah. is cool fabrics, it's yeah. It's really cool fabrics. If you don't want to make that, you can make something else. Yeah. So, there you go. I just love this. That's a very pretty thing. I'm not sure which way to hold it up, but so they get the that whole works. effect. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Nice. Love it. I think that's everything. Are we going to talk about yeah, we can. this? Sure. Cool.
wants a free sewing machine? Um, They're all screaming and yelling. I can hear them now. <laughs> <laughs> so so um, for the Bernina fans out there, Bernina put together a special edition machine this yes. year. It's beautiful, and it comes with luggage. Okay, I gotta come around closer. She's wandering around here. It is a beautiful machine, and it has kind of this iridescent blue on the machine. It has a custom plate on it. it has luggage to match. This is a um, sewing or sewing and embroidery machine, but what's best is you get a free sewing machine with this. So, um, it's a 480 SE is the free machine. Great, great and it's machine. a 790 um, B 790 plus. 790 plus sewing and embroidery machine. Special edition. Special edition with the luggage. Thank you, Marilyn. You're welcome. I can't read that. Um, I know. I'm trying to read through the reflection <laughs> on the you. phone. And I can sort of do it, but I'm not. not yeah, <laughs> don't anyway. Wait. Yeah. But come in and talk to us about this. We have one at Quilters and we have one at Bernina. So mm -hmm. the very limited edition. We only have three or four of them right now. Yep. So so if you're thinking about a new machine for yourself and maybe have something for mm -hmm. another sewer in your life or a machine to take to retreat. Yep. Can't beat that. So All right. A demo? What do you think about a demo? Off to the serger. Okay, let's do that. So, um, first, this is the uh, MO1000 from Juki. It is an air threaded serger. I've got, it comes with a little tray that you can catch your waist with, but I've got it off because I want to show you. I know that you're going to scream, so you would never, ever do this. And then just sew it out. Completely dry. So this machine is so easy to thread, and the nice thing about it is too, like if you if you run Hi, Mary. if you run a spool of thread, I'm gonna get my book here because I'll need that in a minute. If you run your machine out of thread, you don't have to rethread the entire machine. Some sergers you do. So I'm gonna thread the needles first. So this easy. Watch how fast this is. And it has a needle threader for both needles. And you do kind of have to line up your needle and you'll know when it is because it just pops right in there. Right there. Pull that through. I'm going to get my tweezers out. Isn't this nice? You've got this little caddy for all of your tools that you need while you're sewing. So there's one needle. Are you timing me, Robert? Uh, 10, 9, 8, <laughs> 7. I also like that this has separate thread paths for each of the um, threads. Okay. Just push this forward, and then I'm threading the second needle. Hi, Miranda. These are there. There's two. Ten, nine. And then I'm going to thread the loopers. And so all I did is you just turn this. So, so if you see this mechanism, these are your upper and lower loopers. So you just turn that up and then line up those and they snap into place. Thread number three. Straight down. Oh, Roseanne recently got this one. She loves it. It's nice. nice. So you want to pull out enough thread. So I have a pretty good length of thread here. You want to pull out enough so that when you do this, it just shoots all the way through. Look at that. So that's three. 
Ten, nine, eight. <laughs> and just feed it into the air threaded tube. Yep. I'm using the tweezers because yep, you know, nice the thread kind of sticks to my fingers a little bit. Oops, it popped right back out. Hi, Carolyn. Carol? And there it is, right there. Shot through. Shot through. You're going to turn that back down and close your cover. I guess I can put the tweezers away so I don't lose them. I'm Remember gonna to do need, that or you'll be looking for them. I am going to need that in a minute, so I'm going to take it out now. And then I'm going to raise my oh, presser nice. foot. I am going to lower my knife. What's and the purpose of lowering your knife? So that, um, so... You can get underneath there? Yeah, so let me have it pop back up. There it is. So the knife, because I want to put all the threads to the back and I would get caught on the knife. So I'm just going to lower the knife and then just cut them too. And I'm going to pull everything. Hi Cheryl. Hi Tamara. To the back. And I cut that really short with that knife. See that's why you lower the knife because I just cut that. But it should be fine. There we go. So everything is to the back. I'm going to close this. Put the knife back up and test to make sure that we're sewing because it really doesn't matter how fast you thread it if you don't sew when you start. Look at that. Nice. And you're ready so to go. We're ready to go. So what I wanted to show you was in the manual and they really did a nice job with this. I have to find the right page. So this is how you do all of your stitches. So all 15 of these stitches, it will tell you how to do all of them. So I wanted to show you how to do a three thread rolled hem. So it's stitch number eight. And so you have to take out your left needle. And so there's no thread here. So we're going to take that out. Um, right needle is set to four. Upper looper is 3.5, so I'm going to move that. Lower looper is 6, and if you can't tell, so see how it has these symbols? They match the symbols up here on the top of your machine. Nice. Okay, and then your cutting width is set to 1.0, and that's right here, which is what it's set for right now. And then your uh, stitch length is 1.0 so that's this one so all the way down to one and then the differential feed is set to n which is where it's set now and then rolled hem selector lever which is this right here is set to down Right there, I think that's right. We'll test it and see. Um, upper knife is up, and the thread, there's one more attachment right here. So this, if you were doing some specialty stitches, this just moves forward or not. And so in this, it's not engaged. So let's see if I did it right. So napkins. So you can make napkins, which would make really great gifts. Nope, I think I have uh, I didn't take my other needle out. So I did. I did what Marilyn did. I was talking instead of <laughs> paying attention here. So I need to take out 
my left needle. You even got the screwdriver out. I even got of course, the we'll screwdriver out. we all let you do out. it too, so yes. feel kind of bad about that. I'm just going to trim that, trim that there, pull that out, just straight through. And then I'm going to, right. so quick, I'm just going to do a quick thing to get all of that thread out. Nope, I did something wrong. <laughs> something is not quite right. Six, one, and, or maybe it's, I did it backwards. It's live, folks. Anything can happen. Three thread roll tim, stitch length is set to one. So one, and then that is set to N. That's what I did wrong. I had it set to one. So let's see. Got that real quick. What are some of the things you can make with surgery? You're talking about napkins, so. Um, anytime you want to do ruffling, so easy on your surgery. Oh, that needs to be back. That's where my problem is. So look how nice that is. Yeah. Really nice. Yeah. So you had some if you had some fabric like that really pretty um kind of paisley in that kit those would make great napkins you could make napkins for all of your holiday dinners that you're gonna have this coming up season um super easy and you could whip through those like that i bet a lot of people are going to want to get together this year i think so been, so so that's how easy it is um Ruffling, anytime you want to do that. Um, people use sergers to make clothing quite a bit. Um, I use a serger to trim the edges off my quilt before I bind it. It's a game changer for binding, truly. Um, and you can actually piece a quilt on this if you ever get invited to do a jelly roll quilt race. Take your serger, you'll win. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Every time. Because serger is so, so much faster. This machine is eleven ninety nine. Yep. So, um, and you can do all kinds of stuff with it. There's tons of things that you can do. No quilter is complete without it. And, of course, if you make clothing, you know already how much you need a serger. And they are great. We also have a cover stitch, um, chain stitch combo machine, too. So... Cover stitch is that um, stitch. Well, I can't really see it. Your t-shirt's probably better. <laughs> nope, yours is not. Yep. So this is a cover stitch. It does that row of stitches like this together, and then the other side is finished. Gotcha. So, okay. Good and know. chain stitch, if you're doing any clothing, you just chain stitch it, fit it, if it fits, then you surge it. If it doesn't, you can pull those chain stitches right out with one thread and keep going. Well, some of the viewers were admiring your chair here. So oh, these are Really are awesome. great, great chairs, too. And they have storage. Oh, hiding spot. That's right. Hide all those good things. That's where Marilyn keeps her candy. Uh-huh. So at least we'll know where it's at. Just the wooden leg. This one is the hydraulic version of it. Oh, yeah. They did come out with the new patterns, too. The mm -hmm. solids. Solids. This is a nice blue. So I kind of like the loud ones. There we go. But it's a height adjustable. They're very, very comfortable, too. They, they hit you, right? Oh, that's too tall for me. Marilyn must have been sitting in this one. <laughs> so it hits you right in that certain spot in your back. 
So, and when you sew in comfort, you'll get to sew longer. Um, right off the top of my head, I can't think of. <laughs> we found your candy stash. We did. We found your candy stash. These are on sale right now. The hydraulic chairs. So. What's the sale? I want to say it's two ninety nine. They're regularly like three forty nine. Is that for the hydraulic? For the hydraulic chair. Oh, the wooden ones are a little cheaper. Two twenty nine for the wooden ones, I think. Mm -hmm. So, and the hydraulic is well worth it. I yeah, they are yep. nice. They are. Okay, I think that's us for tonight. I hope that you enjoyed it. We need exit music or something. We did. <laughs> na 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 na. <laughs> That wasn't so, quite so, what I had. That's probably copyrighted. I don't know. Uh, or we'd have to pay royalty no, for I it. No, I think that one's old enough. I it's don't think anybody gone. is going to want, they would pay me not to sing. <laughs> <laughs> Send your money in and I won't sing. There you go. <laughs> hey, I like that. We could start a jar. <laughs> a donation jar. Funny, funny. Don't let Joan sing. There you go. go. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do we have a giveaway? We Viewer do. was oh. missing out of the it was giveaway. It was the a pin. Oh, that's right. So make sure that you've commented if you've been on the show, and we will come up with a winner for a pin. We tonight. meaning Chloe. Yeah, yeah. we meaning Chloe. <laughs> Chloe does all the work behind the scenes. She should she be up front. She's our what's, super girl. What's the serger right next to you? This is also an air threaded serger. Um, this is the Elna 864. Um, I don't know what the price is off the top of my head, do you? Um, not off the top of my head, no, I don't. So, it is a little but... bit different. While well, she's looking for the winner, I'll show you. Um, this one uses kind of, is it a baffle? Is that what it's called? Yeah. To push the air through. Yep. Yeah. So, like a puff of air. Different. It has a little puff of air that pushes your thread all the way through. Same thing, you don't have to rethread the entire machine. And, um, you know, under five minutes you can be sewing. <clears throat> I think we have a winner. Yay! Kathy Weber. Kathy Weber, congratulations. Congratulations, Kathy. So you're going to get a little bee. And they're magnets. See, it doesn't, it just sticks on right. Do you know the uh, viewer asked about the weight limit on the chairs? Do you know what they are? I don't. I don't off the top of my head um, what the rating is on them. So. Um, Arrow.com? Or is it arrowcabinets.com? Arrow sewing, I think. Arrow sewing. Well, we'll look it up and post it in the uh, yep. window so that way you yep. don't have to. So. We will post it. And they're off talking, or we would send you off. You yeah, know? you know. How do we send <laughs> off the time? show? And they did comment on the uh, company uniforms. So, oh, these? They're both dressed the same, and they said it was the company uniform. We so, didn't plan at all. But... We only planned the shirts, <laughs> not the jackets, but we think no. alike because we're sisters. <clears throat> they yes. are related. But what it says is read it. All we need is you and me. Oh. And that could mean anybody. That could okay. mean you all and me or her or Joan and me or Robert and me or Chloe. That's probably who it means and me. <laughs> <laughs> so it has a universal meaning. There yeah. you go. We liked them. Yeah. Yep. Do you guys shop together? <laughs> Yes. What would make you think that? Well, you know, I thought it would be kind of yes, like really eerie if you both went shopping separately and came back with the same shirt. We've probably done that too at probably. some point in time. Yeah. Who knows? <laughs> We're and the boss study. is just the opposite. What? <laughs> what? Somebody said the boss is just the opposite. What? Just oh, the opposite. No. Yep. Yeah. Well, next time we'll have <laughs> to get dark and white. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. There you go. She probably wouldn't wear it. Well, how do we send them off? How do we send off the show? Make, Make it, it so. so. All right, everybody, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thanks.